Okay. This time. This time. Everything should be in place. This time. Everything should occur without a hitch. This time, absolutely nothing can go wrong. It only took me three times to do it. But you know what? Sometimes that third time is the charm, as they say. All right. Okay, there we go. Got a little error pop up there, but that's... You know what? I'm not going to think about that. I am simply not going to think about that. I'm simply going to ignore it and think, you know what? We're going to have a fun time. Happy thoughts. Third time's the charm. That's right. This time I load up everything in the way that it's meant to be. And also, I don't set the stream to be children's only. So... I mean, to be fair, the second, the, the second, the second time I went live, that was... That worked, you know, like that, that, that did the thing that it needed to be, needed to do, but I did set the stream to, uh, made for kids and then immediately started swearing. So I had to very quickly go in to my channel settings and delete those forever. Because I know that YouTube takes, uh, content for children very seriously. And so, 30 seconds of me saying, fuck, fuck, shit, fuck, oh god, fuck, probably wouldn't have flown over too well. I haven't been making YouTube videos for long, but I don't want to, I don't want it to all get ruined before I start. People are shooting at me, but that's fine. That's fine, because I found a gun cabinet. Cowboy, oh yeah. It has been a very long time since I played Fallout New Vegas. Even longer since I played a Fallout game, period. All I know is that a man shot me in the head and I need to get my revenge. And also that man was voiced by Chandler Bing. Rip. Was he Joey? I don't know anything about friends. That's... Well, he doesn't look very fun up there. One of my favorite parts about Fallout is that you can just, like... It's very atmospheric. Like, you can just walk around and, you know, sort of take in... The oh, God. All right. Didn't notice you there. Annihilated. But yeah, one of my favorite things about Fallout is that, like, you know, there's a lot of wandering between point A and point B throughout this series, throughout this franchise. But it's a very relaxing wander. Like, sure, it, does, it doesn't have the greatest level of graphical fidelity, but you still feel like you're, you know, exploring a world where adventure could come in every corner. There's a bridge. Have a look where that is. One thing that I appreciate about the vast emptiness of Fallout's Wasteland is that, like, any time there's something that slightly deviates from the norm, you immediately go to it. Like, ooh, what's that? I must investigate. Maybe there'll be a fucking box of bullets I can steal. All I know about New Vegas is that people say it's the good one. And so far, I've just been having a fun time, you know, exploring the wastes. Is that? Oh. Goodbye. Bye. Yeah, this is all environmental storytelling. Does this belong to someone? I'd be stealing this. I mean, probably not, but I'm going to anyway. Corn, can I eat this? No. Be 
feel like, I feel I feel like this shack shouldn't have to be its own like individually rendered environment, but I understand that this is an older game. Any of these things? <gasps> oh, bullets! One thing I love about Fallout, sort of like open world, you know, environmental storytelling kind of deals, is that like, you know, normally in a lot, in like other games, you'll be walking around basically just trying to like pick fights, you know what I mean? Like you'll basically be wandering from place to place, just, you know, shooting dudes up or like getting into brawls, like min max EXP or something. I feel like the older Fallout games have a lot of unique areas like this one, where it's just like, there's nothing here. There is nothing here of value, and you know what, that's that's kind of the point. Like, sure, maybe there's not any, like, unique boot you can get, or, like, unique bosses to fight or anything like that, but it's like, oh, this is well and truly a ruined wasteland. Like, the fact that there is nothing here for anybody is literally the point. And there's a beauty in that. And I appreciate you, Bethesda Softworks of 20 years ago. I guess this one was made by Obsidian. It's quote-unquote the good one. Huh? Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, I'm 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 start I'm starting. Ow, ow. Okay. There we go. No, I don't want to. Want to attack you? You're far too far away. I'm starting to learn that early game. Oh, hello. Early game melee builds is pretty much just a waiting game for people to run up to you. Like, you're, bas you're, bas you're basically just waiting for people to start shit, so they run up to you, so you don't have to run all the way to them, or they shoot you a billion times. Okay, my torso's bungled, that's no good. I'm also realizing, like, how difficult this game is to play on, like, the, um... Not difficult, that's probably not the right word to use. I'm playing on, like, the hardcore mode, where you have, like, hunger and thirst as well. And so far, the thing that's getting me most is the fact that you can't heal body parts with stim packs. Like, okay, I have a, I have, I have a ruptured torso. That's bad, because that's where all my organs are. And I can't do shit about it. Because I need to, I need to find a doctor, I guess. And I'm so early on in the game that I simply do not know where any of those live. Wait a second, I was saved by a doctor in the fucking opening cutscene. I can just go to him. What the hell was I thinking? You literally start the game in a doctor's office. Okay, I need to... Yes, yes, yes. I know, I, I know, I know my torso was ruptured. And I very badly need to go to a doctor to heal my many, many busted limbs. And also to alleviate my addiction to scotch. Which I got by consuming scotch one time. The RNG did not favor me there, I can tell you that much. Hello. How are you holding up? You don't look like nothing. Okay. Um, hello? Oh, okay. Okay, so all my limbs are fixed. And now I need you to cure my crippling scotch addiction. Sure, I... Okay. Uh, 
Goodbye. You take care now. Hello? What? Uh, uh. Uh. Alright. Yes, the RNG gods did not bless me in this playthrough. I took one sip of scotch, and immediately I couldn't put the stuff down. Just like real life, I guess. Okay, what's... What's waiting for me in Nipton? Hey, scoozy. Oh, okay, so it's just it's one of those it's just one of those early game things where it's like, yeah, you got you gotta get all the way over here. But like we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna siphon you past this way so you actually go down the right roads, so you don't just end up trying to walk over a bunch of mountains and getting frustrated. Kinda like the yellow paint of Fallout. Is it, is it treating the players like children? A little bit, probably. But I need the help. Ooh. Is that what I think it is? I think it is. Ooh. Ooh. I don't know why, but I always get stupidly stressed out about the frag mines. Like I know all you need to do to dis all you need to do to disarm them is just run up to them and press A. But every time I try and do that, I uh, feel like I'm inches away from disaster. Especially this early on in the game where I'm so weak and vulnerable to everything. Did I walk through here before? Probably. Down there, something. Yeah, that's where the farm was. At least they give you roads to follow. That's nice. Yep. Can I eat this? No. Wait, can I eat this? No. Holy shit. Uh, 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 uh. I want to hit the one that's like super close to me and like actively biting my ankles. Uh. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> I love Bethesda games. Am I playing on console? No, I'm playing on the Steam Deck. That funky little handheld computer PC console hybrid. So kind of yes, kind of no. Get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> I love the physics. physics. Oh, I'm very badly hurt. These things literally took out half of my hit points, and I got absolutely no no feedback for that. No sound effects, no nothing. Time to do my favorite thing in RPGs. And that's to eat a whole lot of food. Yum, yum. Dirty water, dirty water. Uh... Oh, they got some 
Get Kakala. There we go. That should be good enough. Oh wait, never mind. I'm playing on hardcore mode. That's absolutely not good enough. Hello? You good? You good over there? I'm 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 not getting involved with this. They they seem to have their own thing going on. Just gonna just gonna take this, this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and these two. Delicious. Okay, like, I know, I know, I know the Legionaries are the bad guys, but, like, they're just, they're just chasing down a fleeing man. That still violates some kind of convention. But you know what? It ain't my race. I haven't made any enemies in this playthrough yet. I don't think, anyway. I mean, the Powder Gangers don't like me, but they're they're kind they're kind of like the tutorial faction. They introduce you to the honor system. Like I'm currently heralded as a hero in Good Springs, but I don't think that I don't think that does anything really. That's just the intro to whatever like black and white morality system they have. Hello. Oh. Oh, that's... that's unfortunate. You like that? No. Very actively. Uh, uh. Wow, this, 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 this fight is embarrassing for everybody involved. Like, nobody is on their A-game here. Like, okay, we're, we're... we're... we're really just phoning it in, aren't we? Oh my god. Oh yeah, like, everyone's getting back into Fallout now. Even people who had no interest in Fallout are getting into Fallout. Hello? Can I... There's another one there, she's still gonna try and kill me. I, I, I need... I need to be able to move... See what I'm doing. Thank you. Ow. Yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm no different to anybody else, honestly. Like, I... I started watching the TV show, and I'm like, hey, this is a whole... this is a whole lot of fun! They should make a video game about this. And boy, was I surprised. I was not surprised. I've I played Fallout. I've played Fallout games before. I've beaten New Vegas once a very long time ago when I was far too young to... I don't know. Appreciate the... The, uh... Appreciate its substance. Sure, that sounds right. Who's that? Huh, must have been the wind. I feel like sometimes I just throw, like, gunshots and explosions in there just to fuck with you. Maybe I'm paranoid. Hello. Do people live here? Can I steal from here? No, but if I steal from here, my karma will go down. I'm too much of a good boy to not let that affect me. slowly getting lead poisoning, but that's fine. Alright. 
sleep in these? Okay, talk to you. McCarran doesn't like it when civilians wander into military outposts. So if you're here on business, better make it quick. Oh, you're just a barrel of laughs, ain't you? Radio signal out here can be pretty spotty because of all the hills. Sometimes our scheduled updates don't go through. When it happens enough times, they send someone over to check up on us. Lately, we've been getting extra medical supplies for some reason. I'm in no rush to give the supplies back, either. I shouldn't have said anything in the first place. And I'd rather not get you into the habit of crossing the NCR. All quiet at the moment. Ranger Beaumont is in charge here, but he's off leading a patrol. Ah, so much bull in this game. I got. I feel like I go through moods with New Vegas, where it's like, you know, sometimes I'm just gonna roll around and you know listen to every single piece of lore the game has to offer. Other times, I'm just like, hey, I want to go beat up a death claw with my bare hands. And that's going to be my life's mission today. And it changes by the day, honestly. Actually, how am I going for sleep? I should probably... I'm good. I feel like I feel like it's gonna be very easy for me to forget that I'm playing on hardcore mode. So I think I'm just gonna go the equivalent of like wandering through the wasteland for three days without sleep. I'm very easily distracted in video games and in real life. <gasps> Is that a fucking dinosaur? Oh yeah. Oh, that's right. That's where. That's where. That's where. That's where what's his face lives? Booner. <laughs> Booner. Spurs the jingle. He like shoot at you if you come in from the wrong way. See this 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 right here, this is world building. This is this is the writing we love to see in Fallout games. It's called Novak. This is the only part of the sign that's still working. I swear to god, I've, I've, I've played this game like three times to get up to this point, and it took me far, far longer than I, I, I... Far longer than it's like healthy for me to admit. I realized that was the case. You? Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit if it ain't my old friend from Good Springs. What the hell are you doing here? Don't rightly know. Just got the notion to make my way to New Vegas. Reckon I'll find out when I get there. Huh? Novak? Nice enough place, I suppose. But between you and me, when I rolled into town, my skin started to itch. Watch yourself. I don't like... I don't like robots... I don't like a robot who's clearly an automaton made of steel implying that he has skin. That doesn't sit right with me. Likewise, friend, likewise. Is there anything old Vic can do you for? Mm. That's a mighty fine offer, but I'm gonna need to conserve my strength if I'm gonna make it all the way to New Vegas. I'm sure you'll do just fine without old Vic slowing you down. One of my favorite things about New Vegas and some of the other Fallout games is that, like, People can just say no to you. Like, they got their own shit going on. Like, I feel like in a lot of modern RPGs, it's like, you know, you are the main character. You are the protagonist. Everyone bends over backwards to make sure you have everything you need from items, guns, weapons, superpowers. 
in New Vegas is like, hey, want to come along and be my companion? And they're just like, no. I, d I don't want to do that. No, don't believe I did. But you might ask around. The Novak folk usually see anyone traveling this way. No, I can't do it. I can't. I can't be mean to the friendly robot. Be seeing you. I'm the kind of guy that thanks the self checkouts after I use them, just because I, 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 I can't not. It's instinctive. Ooh. Hello. Oh. Oh. I, I, I fully don't know whether or not... I have no idea if the karma system in this game actually does anything. But anytime I steal something, it tells me my karma's gone down. And I... I, I take that personally. I can't do that. I, I, I can't steal anything. Maybe that makes me a weak little beta cuck. I don't know. Hello? Hey there. Buy something from a shop, you'll have to wait till it opens. God, the lighting in these games are something. Sure, but he didn't buy any souvenirs, if that's what you're wondering. Sounded like he didn't have his money with him. His friends seemed disappointed about it. Heck, I would be too if I found such a fine store and left my money elsewhere. Manny might know more about him. Thought he might have been friends with one or two of them. He's up in the dino mouth during the day. I need to... I, I, I fully need to Google how to play Caravan because I tried to play one game uh, and immediately lost all of my caps. Oh, that's... You're a weird guy, man. You're a weird guy. Hello? Hey, welcome. We haven't met yet. You must be new in town. I'm Andy. That's a very cordial greeting for a guy who just broke into your home. Right now, a whole lot of sitting on my keister and counting cracks in the ceiling. I wouldn't wish it on anybody. On better days, I help keep the peace. Boone and Vargas watch the road. I watch the town. Tell myself I'm doing some good. Was. Was with them. That was back when my arm and leg used to work better. I still like to pretend I'm a ranger, though. I'll check in with the guys up at the station pretty regular on the ham radio. Sometimes they stop by and tell me they're paying their respects, the smug bastards. They haven't been responding to me the last couple days. I guess they got tired of hearing me talk, but it still got me a little worried. Hell, listen to me talk, like some damn mother hen. I'm so averse to doing mean playthroughs in video games, but Fallout New Vegas really makes it... it re they really make it tempting. No, I'll go check on his friend. I'll go check on his friends. Uh, no. No, they're gonna think I'm having oh. trouble letting go. They're good soldiers. I don't give them enough credit. Okay. I thought I was about to get a quest there. Hey, uh, wait a sec. I know what I said, but if you find yourself by Ranger Station Charlie, let me know what you find. I'd be interested. Now that's good character writing. I... Oh. He's got a- he's got, he's got a book in his bed, and I very much want to take that. I don't know if it's a book or a magazine? Either way, I want it. Yes. Oh, oh god damn it. What if I um let's do this. Nobody suspects a thing. God, I love Bethesda games. Oh shit. Okay, now I'm over-encumbered. It was that, uh... Oh, yes!
I love it when skimming the index of a, of a medical publication gives me, like, actual medical knowledge. Ah! God damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that. What do you want? Yeah, I guess maybe I am. But not like you. Huh. Maybe it should have been you I was expecting all along. Why are you here? <laughs> I think you better leave. Okay. Um. I don't have friends here. Wow, edgy. All right. No. No, you're not, are you? Maybe you shouldn't go. Not just yet. Not unless you give me a reason. I need someone I can trust. <laughs> you're a stranger. That's a start. It's you! You! I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come, what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. This guy talks like he wants to be a... He wants, he wants to be the main character of this game. My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. I know, all right. That's all you need to know. All right, anytime somebody in a video game says that's all you need to know, that immediately makes me distrustful of them. I don't believe that's all I need to know. I fully believe that you have further information that I could use that I probably need. Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal so I know you're standing with him. I need to do this myself. Good. I'll make it for <laughs> a while. And one more thing. We shouldn't speak again. Not until it's over. No one in town knows that I know what happened to my wife. Best they never know. Or the Legion will be after me next. God, without your hat, your head is like twice as long as I thought it was. Acts like a war movie character. God, so true. He sounds like a war movie char war movie character who's never actually like seen a conflict in his life. He's bald. The wig has well and truly been snatched. All right, I should probably like track that quest because I kind of want to do that. I can ask you. Vic, Vic, Vic. Tell me. No? Okay. Okay. I feel like a lot more of the quests in New Vegas have to do with, like, you know, investigating mysteries. Like, I'm trying to find... Like, I'm trying to find the guy who took Boone's wife. I'm not just going down and, like, shipping rad scorpions. Hey, any word on Station Charlie? Carla was a knockout. Whenever Boone walked around with her, he always had this funny grin on his face like he couldn't believe his luck. Oh, he's depressed now. That's sad. That wasn't the only reason she stuck out, though. That girl never minced words. If she'd had better food or hospitality, she'd let you hear it. Trouble was, she usually had. I don't think she meant it. She really was a sweet girl. I think she just wanted to remind herself that there's still nicer places in this world than Novak. Who could blame her for that? Had his wife taken. I don't think he'll ever be the same as he was. Damn shame. I told the rangers up at the station to keep an eye out, but there's just too much ground out there for them to cover. <laughs> Look out for yourself. Honestly, New Vegas is mostly mysterious ways. That got so true. Ah! Way brighter than I thought it would be. But yeah, at least it at least it has some variety, you know. Like combat's fun, but sometimes sometimes I want to be immersed 
fantastical post-apocalyptic world. You want to buy something from a Can't say we spoke much. Boone did most of the buying for her. She was in the store once, but she didn't stay long. Had a look on her face like she'd smelled something sour. As far as I can remember, the gift shop smelled fine. Well, fine as it always was. Come back soon now. Back full level for gameplay. Yeah, that's 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 a fair assessment. I do like Fallout 4's like um, more polished systems, for lack of a better term. And like its story wasn't bad at the end of the day. Like it was fine. I think I think it was just very safe. Like it was a it was it was a triple A, um, it was a triple A action RPG. You know what I mean? Um, is there any rooms that I can actually? No, no one lives up here. I should get into modding though. Like I'm playing this on the Steam Deck, so I feel like modding it's going to be a difficult prospect. But I just need to hook up a mouse and keyboard to it. What's going on, man? Why you? I'm Manny. I'm on security detail here. You see a rifle barrel sticking out of the dinosaur's mouth, you got a 50-50 shot it's me. Otherwise, it's Boone. God, the lighting in this game is so scary. You name it. Anything that comes within a thousand yards that looks like trouble. Lately, we've been getting ghouls coming from the road to Repcon out to the west. Quite a few last couple days. The big threat is the Legion coming from the east. If they decide to attack with a full force, they'll run us over. But so far, we've been lucky. Who's Boone? A sniper, same as me. Used to spot for him when we were enlisted with the NCR. After we got out, I talked him into settling down here. So, here we are. I'd introduce you, but uh, we're not so friendly right now. Oh. Why are you on bad terms with Booney Boy? One day, she turns up missing, and he hasn't said a word to me since. Why his eyes glowing like that? God, that's that's exactly the answer. I, that's exactly the question I want to know the answer to. That's piercing. That's horrific. Man, you name it. See, I grew up in North Vegas. Me and my cousins. We were some bad seeds. Got in with a gang. I loved it. Then something happened, and I couldn't handle it anymore. So, I enlisted, earned my future, brought down my best friend to share that future with me. And here was this woman, who was too good for it, trying to take him away. So yeah, I didn't see eye to eye with the bitch. Whoa, okay, she's dead. Let's not, let's not do that. Did you hear Fallout 4 is getting a major update with console? Yes, I did hear that, and I heard it's absolutely going to break the big community mod project that everybody's been working on. Which is very unfortunate. I feel like I do want to play Fallout 4 again at some point, but I, ha I have limited space on my rig right now, so I'm like, okay, do I have to uninstall 20 different things so I can play Fallout New Vegas, or do I just want to install... Uh, do, do I want to install a hundred... Do I want to uninstall 100 different things just so I can play Fallout 4, or do I want to install, like, 10 gigabytes worth of New Vegas? And here we are. She wanted to sit in a room all day and make herself miserable, and she went out of her way to be rude. She upset a lot of people. You wouldn't have liked her either. Believe me, when I heard the news, my first thought was, I owe somebody big. I figured Boone would come around after a while. But he hasn't. I'm starting to think that if he doesn't find her, things will never go back to the way they were. He's staring into the deepest parts of your soul. What's really getting what's really getting me is that like you know his his eyes look like a solid black. There's just like a there's just like a tiny little white dot in there. It's like not realistic lighting. Were they tough? I was in the cons, man. It doesn't get any badder. Okay, I feel like. Yeah, see ya. I feel like this guy's the red herring. I feel like this is this is the guy that you know you're supposed to run towards. So you can be like, oh, you know, this this guy did it. 
But I don't think that's true. Ooh. One day there, maybe there. Okay, so he's still... He's, he's, he's still running with some bad guys, by the sounds of things. I didn't quite read that email, but all I know is that I got a quest from it, so... I can glean things from the context clues. Cues? Clues? Blah-blah-blah-blah. Get a feeling Boone killed his wife? Ooh, now that would be... That would be dramatic. Ooh la la. They're like... Okay, how many rooms do I actually need to check? Okay, so there's like other... There's other people I can talk to and meet. Okay, is there someone in here? Oh! Oh! Well, welcome to you. You look tired from the road. Why don't you relax a spell? Let this fine town take care of you. You did it. You did it. How should I put it? I guess you could say she was kind of like a cactus flower. Real pretty to look at, but there was just no getting close to her. She never did take to living here. She liked the big lights and fast living of New Vegas. I got the feeling she was trying to get Boone to leave with her, but I guess she got tired of waiting. Oh. Maybe that's right. Nothing that wouldn't be wrong with any man who loses a wife, I suppose. Poor dear. I know he thinks she was kidnapped, but I'm not so sure she didn't just run off on her own. You could tell she was thinking about it ever since they arrived. Okay, so you're like the the, the, the the town gossip. Watch out for strangers. I don't okay, I don't I don't think you did it, but I think you like to gossip about it. I I I think you like the tea. And you know what? I can respect that. Someone who lives around here. See, the worst part is I like I know I've played this quest at some point in my young life. And I've definitely got the answer right. But I still have no idea who it could possibly be. Oh, oh, oh. What brings you here? Sorry, I just broke into your home. Never mind. Boom. That's that sniper fella. Works in the dinosaur, right? I only met them but once or twice. They seem real happy together. I really ought to get to know them better. They're probably nice folks. Mmm, you're sowing the seeds. You're, you're trying to make me think that you haven't had a lot of contact with him. Oh, we keep to ourselves for the most part. Try not to pry. I think Jeannie Mae gets bothered that we aren't more sociable. But it's just our way. Ain't that we don't appreciate what she's done, managing this town like she has. And I worry she feels that way anyhow. Not that there ain't others who pry around here. That no-bark was skulking around our yard last week. <laughs> I thought he was our cow killer. Was about to lash him with our bull whip till I saw who it was. He's harmless, though. Part of me wishes I could see things like he sees them. All full of mystery. The hell is Nobok? I'm not sure who started it. It wasn't a very nice name, but he took to calling himself by it, so we all had to. I don't even remember what his real name is. Anyway, I think it comes from that expression that people say when you're crazy. That not all of your dogs are barking. Poor no bark. Oh, well, I'm Alice, and that handsome stranger yonder is my husband Dusty. Going on fifty years now. I keep waiting for him to. You are not fifty. Thing with platinum blonde hair and hoop earrings, but he still sticks around. Says it's my cooking. I think it's because I know which Brahmin utter you can milk without getting kicked in the noggin. That is entirely an unintelligible sentence. Okay, where's this other guy? Oh. Okay, so... They have a cuck chair. That's fine. It's, it's obvious, but it's fine. Things treating you all right. God, can I not... Can I not just, like, shine a flashlight in his face while I'm talking to him? Like, this is... This is spooky, man. Well, to be honest with you, I don't really know them two as well as I might. 
I remember she had an edge about her, like she'd rather be someplace else. This kind of life ain't for everyone, that's for darn sure. <laughs> oh, I tend to my ranch, that's about it. Alice will tell you, I don't get out a whole lot. You must mean what's left of it. Somebody's been attacking our animals at night. We're down to less than half of what we had a few weeks back. Every night around midnight, Alice and I wake up to some crazy hollering and gunshot. You'd think the world was ending all over again. But it's just one animal each night. They don't take it or carve it up or nothing. Just leave it there, all full of holes. We'd be grateful, especially if you find them before they get in the whole stock. But don't go getting yourself killed over it. Alice and I'll find a way to make do. Always have. Beg your pardon, mister, but them two-headed beeves ain't worth... Not to mention what would happen if half of what Nobark says is true. Best we can hope is that whoever's doing this will move on or get tired of it. I just hope it happens while we still got animals left. Whoever it is, I don't think they're from around town. Seems like they've taken to shooting from the west side. So long. I mean, can I just bring anybody out front to get shot by Boone? Like, how's he gonna know? Like, all he asked me to do was to bring someone out front, put on a funny little hat, and he'll blow their brains out. I don't feel like that's a very good system to have. Oh, okay, okay, there's no one in here. Wasn't there a quest marker in here? Wasn't there someone I could talk to? Oh, just, uh... It's an empty home with blammo mac and cheese that I can steal. Yoink. Yeah, there's a... Oh, no, the, the quest marker's going behind the house. Good lord. Okay. I don't know, I remember I remember playing this this quest when I was younger and and going like, oh okay, this is clearly the person who did it. Like I feel like I got it super quickly when I was like thirteen. Hello? What? How do you Who sent you? I ain't talking. Just try to get me. Okay, you you look at me at least, that's nice. Ornery? You sure now? It's kind of hard to hear you. Okay, okay, just speak up a little. It's not so much that they hear you. They've got people everywhere, always listening. Seen it all. Seen shadowy folk come to his room and leave again in the middle of the night. Thought one might have gone in the lobby too for a spell. Could be oh. a person went in to get something. Or use the John, maybe. Mighty interesting either way, if you ask me. I thought it was cannibals. Come to eat us all for sure. So I kept out of sight. But now I know better. More <laughs> rat men. Come up from the oh. to steal young women with promises of riches and fancy mud mansions with all the latest designer appliances. They covered our lady folks' long hair for wigs, it said, and they were either bald or balding themselves. The writers of this game absolutely knew what they were doing, giving the absolutely insane man the only usable information out of, out of anyone in town. I don't trust a man that doesn't have something strange going on about him, because it means he's hiding it from you. If a man's wearing his pants on his head, or if he says his words backwards from time to time, you know it's all laid out there for you. But if he's friendly... God, to so true. ...and keeps his home spick and span, more often than not, he's done something even his own ma couldn't forgive. He's literally, he's literally describing every, like, white-collar criminal there's ever been. I mean, he's not so happy, upset, ang ang angry, disgruntled. Man, this... 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 This crazy homeless man is incredibly well spoken, and you know what? Good for him. If anyone asks, he never spoke. 
I love you, Nobark Noonan. Okay, maybe, may, maybe, maybe not so much anymore. That's the mannequins is kind of weird, man. Hello. Um. Okay. Hey. What can I do for you? Okay. Just, uh, just a bunch. All right, you're just gonna. Okay, that's... God, I love Bethesda games. <laughs> okay, I have to look for clues in the lobby. At least that's... At least it gave me a lead. Right, where are we going? Where are we dropping? Is this the lobby? Or was he talking about the lobby of the dinosaur? I probably should have been paying attention. No, that's a gift shop. Dude, what, are you, what are you doing here? Hello? Hey there. Need anything? You know what? Maybe I do. Here's what I got. Bullets. Bullets. Actually, what can I get rid of? That's probably that's probably my most important question right now. When you're playing on hardcore mode, it's like carry weight gets very, very weird. Um, ah, oh, do I want to give up the metal armor? You know, it's very, it's very, it's very heavy. I, I think I can do without it. All that. It's actually proving that having things like mannequins around when you're Alone, rather than be completely alone, keeps your madness away. Okay. You know what? The next time I feel like I'm going fully insane, I will keep that in mind, and I will have, and I and I and I will be sure to procure some mannequins of my own. Probably, I can probably get rid of some dynamite. I don't need thirty-three sticks of dynamite. I think. I think I'll be fine with 20 sticks of dynamite to my name. I mean, if I was ever locked in a room with absolutely no social contact, I, I, I think I might just, I think I might start, I think I might pick up World of Warcraft. I think that, I think that'll be my litmus test. Okay. First try. Oh? Okay. Okay, bill of sale. I, I missed the quest marker. Okay, um, bill of sale. We the representatives. Okay. Jeannie Mae Crawford. <gasps> Was it her? Did I get it right? Jeannie May? Oh, Jeannie May. How could you? Okay, also I need it to be I need it to be nighttime, so I need to Fuck, I guess I guess just stand here for twelve hours? Actually you know what I'm gonna get a room. I'd like to rent a room. I think that's a fine idea. I'll give you a good flat rate, and you can stay as long. I'm glad you can stay with us. Your room will be the one ups. Here's your key. Let me know if there's anything I can do to make your stay better for you. You know what? I think I think this I think this is gonna be fine. Like, sure, I just spent a hundred caps on this on this room, but she is gonna get a brains blown out. So I can just I can just take that back, right? I can just take that back. It's fine. Ooh, swanky. Okay, let's see. Is there anything in here I can steal beforehand? Hello? <gasps> That's a lot of vodka. I mean, I know it's a hotel room, but to walk walk in with five bottles of vodka, that's... That feels like a lot. Shouldn't have that much vodka. 
Ow. Okay, well this is... That's, that's a lot going on there. Okay. Did I get a bonus for having a full, like, good night's sleep? I should, right? My immersion will be broken if I don't. Man, can you imagine just hitting the bed and going to sleep for a full 13 hours? Oh, I'm well rested. Good, good. I love that for me. Also, hey, receptionist lady, uh, come with me for no reason. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. You're never getting this money back. No! Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and plain forgot to tell. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel. Well, damn, now I know her name. Now it's not going to be... Now it's not going to be easy for me to lure her out front. We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel, and it's mine. How should I... Okay, I feel like... Um... Well, I need to... I need to... I need to, I need to get her to come with me. I, I feel like there's a... Um... Well, there's Dainty, the town... I feel I feel like there's a Well up north. I feel like there's a um I feel like there's a dialogue option I need to hit. I hope you find How do I How do I get her to come with me? That's what I need to know. Go see Cliff Briscoe at the Dino Bite gift shop. And tell him I sent you. I think he gets lonely standing around in that dino belly all day. He'll be glad for the company. I just know what I've heard. There's supposed to be some ghouls that went in a while back. Ever so often there'll be a commotion from that direction. Explosions and such. Watch out for strangers. I didn't... I didn't end the conversation. What, what are you doing? <laughs> How do I get you to follow me? That's what I need to- that's what I need to do, right? Nope, that's- no, that's not what I want! That's absolutely not the button that I wanted to press. Okay, what am I doing? Quests. Okay. I hope you find- You can jump out. You've got no right- we do the... Well, it is. Okay, how do I get her to follow me? Watch out. Do I have to wait till she's not working? Maybe? Oh, maybe. I hope you find... Watch out. Okay. Okay, do I have to wait till she's in her home? Alright. Can I get you to follow me now? Mm. Did, I, did I read the note wrong? Okay, so it is her! It is, it is her! But well, I need her to go out there. You know, I'm just gonna... No! To... No! I always press the wrong button. Um, Boone's Beret. <laughs> Gets mad because the NPC ends a conversation. <laughs> Look. I hope you listen. To your liking. I'm not perfect. Okay, but she's not gonna, not gonna follow me, which is 
Do I have to start this conversation when she's in her home? I feel like there's some very specific condition that needs to be met in order for me to lure her to her death. Maybe she just needs to go to bed for the night. Okay, I've, I've fully just followed this woman from her place of work to her home. I understand that what I'm doing is bad and wrong. Hello. Hey there. Is everything alright? Awful late to be dropping in unexpected. Why would you come with me? Watch out for strangers. Okay, maybe I've just mis maybe I've just misinterpreted. Wait, is Boone up during the day or is he up at night? Have I just completely got the times wrong? Okay. I fucked it up. I fucked it up. Let me just double check if Boone's even in there. How you doing? Ah, hello. Okay, so now, okay, now Boone's Boone's going to the job. All right. It's in midday. Okay. 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 I feel like I'm trying to do my taxes. I got no idea what's happening, but I'm giving it my best. Okay. So Boone is in the dino. I repeat, Boone is in the dino. Hello. Hey there. Is everything all right? Okay, there we go. Okay, if that's what you think. I mean, for somebody who's literally, like, selling people into slavery, uh, you're awfully trusting. You also walk in... <laughs> this is probably the best walking animation I've seen in a AAA video game. Sweetie, it's okay, you can run. You don't have to, you don't have to hustle. You don't have to hustle. You don't have to do whatever this is. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. Now the real question is, Bo is Boone gonna ask me for his hat back? If it's all the same to you, I kinda wanna keep it. Oh, okay. Yoink. I take. I take this key. Listen, I knew that was going to happen, but I was still taken aback by it. <laughs> it's Bethesda, of course, they have to hustle. A regular. A, 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 a regular running animation would be too much to ask for. That's it then. How did you know? No. <sighs> Look, I kind of, I kind of want to do an evil jackass playthrough, but like this, this guy misses his wife. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. It'd be like them to keep paperwork. Here, this is all I can give. I think our dealings are done here. What will you do now? I won't be staying, I know that. Don't see much point in anything right now, except hunting legionaries. Maybe I'll wander. Like you. Come with me. I don't want to do that. Yeah, that might be true. That's reason enough for me to take you up on it, I suppose. But this isn't gonna end well. Fine. Let's get out of here. You are such a drama queen. Come with me. We're gonna kill a whole bunch of people. But first, I'm gonna rob your hometown. Just, just saying. No, but then I'll lose karma, and I don't want to do that. Ooh, but this door can be open though. 
Oh, uh... Um... Why are the rockets irradiated? Why are the rockets... Why are the rockets giving me the irradiate... Why are they giving me radiation? Boone has joined your party. Now it's officially a party. Okay, what does well rested give me? I know I got that for having a good night's sleep. Should I... That's well rested. Plus 10% EXP. Yo, that slaps. I'm gonna get so many levels in. I didn't even need the safe key. I broke into this before. <sighs> Immersion broken. Shut up. There's a weapon that shoots those model rockets? Oh my god, really? Should I just steal all of them? Should I take all of those rockets? I don't think they weighed anything, so I don't think there would be anything necessarily detrimental to me having a fuck ton of irradiated rockets in my inventory. Yeah, they have no weight, so... This is... 49... Thank God. This feels... This... Okay, I stole something, and I don't know what I stole. I think maybe one of the rockets was marked as illegal. Holy shit. What am I gonna... This feels game-breaking. Like, I feel like I'm gonna have all these things in my inventory, like, even if I can sell- even if I can only sell them for, like, one cap each, I'm still gonna have, like, two- like, fucking 500 caps after this. What is the source of radiation in this room? I have to know. This is... this is ridiculous. Okay. Rockets, 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 rockets. Beef. I mean, I guess this is... I guess this is the souvenir store. Alright. <laughs> okay, I need to know, how many did I actually take? Let's see. Um, I don't... Yeah, yeah, I'll just keep them with me. Um, 100! Alright. My guy? That's too many rockets. Okay, quests... Where's, where's this? Where's this on the world map? You know, I could just run over and get I could just run over and save some guys. Oh. I thought the junk jet was only like a Fallout 4 thing. I guess, I guess, I guess that sounds reasonable enough that it's a... What do you call it? A, um... Ow. A franchise staple. Oh my god, these guys are hitting way harder than- Oh god! Oh my god! Uh, uh, uh... Hey, this is- this is a bad spot that I'm in. Ah, ah, ah! This is a this is not a this is not a good spot for me. Ha ha Boone, please. It's okay, the legionaries are tough, but as soon as you get as soon as you get one of them, the rest just start to run away. I definitely did that. I definitely did that and not Boone.
That was definitely all me. Boon, please. Oh, nope, that's absolutely not the button I wanted to press. Let's see, okay, um... Just gonna immediately, immediately get radiation sickness. Look at this. Okay, so this is like a monster energy drink that, like, fucks up your endocrine system. Eat fruit. Wow, I'm significantly more hurt than I should be. I think I need to, like, find a campfire and actually cook some good food. I'm not even talking about the game, I'm talking about real life. Instead of leveling up my medicine, I'm I'm trying to like level up my survival instead. So instead of using actual like, you know, proper medicinal things like stim packs and doctor's bags, I can just like make some absolutely bomb jambalaya. And like subsist on that. Cause you know what, that would be my strategy in real life. Oh. Okay, so the music... When the music starts getting real, that's when you know shit's, shit's, shit's about to go down. I... Okay, this... The screen is incredibly unhelpful. Survival of melee should be my focus. Well, good, because that's currently what they are. I don't normally go for, um, I don't normally go for melee-oriented builds in games like this. Um, oh, I'm shunned by Caesar's Legion. Oh, that's unfortunate. How does word keep getting out? I keep killing everybody. Is it possible to even be in the good graces of Caesar's Legion? Because, like, they attack you everywhere you go. Now, the powder gangers don't like me, so you're immediately gonna, like, try and kill me? Nope, you're just gonna... You're just gonna run off into the distance. Okay. Ooh, a campfire. See, there's so many, like, campfire recipes that, like, I feel like I want to start fucking around with. But I just don't have my survival leveled up enough. Oh well. Nothing I can do about it. I lied! There is something I can do about it. Okay, melee weapons. Which is already significantly higher than any other stat that I have. Good lord. Okay, as long as science gets up to 25, I can then use that to, like, hack terminals. Things like that. Yeah, like, lockpick and science... Lockpick, science, and speech are, like... You know, there's 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 no playthrough where those aren't going to be helpful. Maybe I want to get good at explosives, too. No? No perks? Well, that's unfortunate. <gasps> I could cook steak now! Yes! That's exactly what I wanted! Oh, hello. 
No, hey, hey, video game? I don't want to attack, I don't want to attack Boone. I don't know why you would even think I would want to do this. First of all, he's all the way over there, and I'm holding a fucking machete. Second of all, there's a guy right at my ankles trying to rip my tendons out. Priorities, please. Also, if I beat him to death, he does that, and that's always delightful every time. Okay, I'm gonna eat one of those gecko steaks now, because, like, I am... I'm a hungry boy. I'm also a hungry boy in real life. Which I feel like is a problem for me. Alright, so I have one quest that's literally just spread word of Legion atrocities. I wonder if I can do that without upsetting people. Like, can I just go up to someone and be like, hey, you know, shit's fucked? Or is he gonna hate me if I do that? Heard you helped out Jackson. Thanks for that. Caravans are still waiting for clearance to move out, but at least there's movement. What? There's no way. We're miles from the Colorado. They, they aren't even waiting for the dam to fall. They're already inside the borders. We'll never stop them. Not at this rate. We're doomed. Thanks for bringing the word. Even if the news is bad, I'll let the men know. Well, that's good. Hey, that was a really easy way to get some EXP. Yeah, that's interesting to me, because that quest was like... I feel like it was pitched as a Caesar's Legion quest. It really ends up helping the NCR more. Okay, now I need to actually... Now I need, now I need to actually get back to finding the guy who shot me in the head. I feel like that should be my, my main goal. Uh. Is there like a button you can press that like automatically makes you walk? Or am I just misremembering that? Fucking road, Jesus. Jesus Christ. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god, who's who's doing that? Okay, where was where were these fu where was this fucking dynamite coming from? Okay, so, like, my arms are fucked up now.
I think that absolutely destroyed, like, multiple of my limbs. Both of them! Okay, alright. Um, okay. Does sleep fix your limbs? I think I'm gonna go give that a shot. First of all, I'm just gonna, like, discover this waypoint. So I can then... Fast travel back to Novak. Sleep in my big comfy bed. That I stole from the woman who I eventually murdered. By proxy. I didn't kill her myself. Now, do we follow... Do we follow Dungeons and Dragons rules? Does a long rest heal all of your broken bones? Also, will Boone get into bed with me? This is what I need to know. God, can you imagine taking a 15-hour nap? I feel like that would solve all of my problems. Did it do it? Did it work? Oh yeah! My arms are not broken, but I am very thirsty. Which, honestly... That's kind of how... That's kind of how waking up after a rough night is. Ooh. Speaking of rough nights, I think I'm going to call it there for now. I should probably eat some food. It was one of those times where I was like, oh, you know what? Work is over. I'm going to play some video games. Throw on a bit of a stream. Chill out. And now I'm like, hey, you haven't eaten since 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 three o'clock today. Like, what's what's going on, man? What's happening? Why are you doing this? I don't know why looking at my own face lags this lags my Steam Deck so much. That's actually kind of crazy. Anyway, I think I'm gonna call it there for now. So. Thanks for coming in and hanging out. It's always a fun time to play some games and chill. I'm going to take off, have something to eat, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your night. Take care. Except now I have to really awkwardly... I have to really awkwardly, like, shut the, shut the, shut the stream down because there's no... I don't have any hotkeys or nothing. I really, I really just have to press the buttons in real time. Like, there's no... There's no good way that I have to do this. Like, there's not any, like, I don't have any means or funk, like, I, I, I got, I, 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 oh, that joke would have been way better if it didn't have a pop-up after that. Fuck.